Hi guys, in this tutorial I am going to show you how you can fix this error, the error that we get on Android devices, that is unfortunately the process android.process.echo has stopped, okay? So how you can fix that, I am going to show you, you know, a couple of methods and you can try that out and let's see and if it works out for you or not, okay? So, so the method one we have is, you know, uh, you know, we have to, you know, clear the data of the contacts and the contacts stories okay so before doing this uh, you have to take backup of your contacts okay so we need one app uh, so you need to go to you know, the play store and in the search box over here you need to type this super backup okay okay and uh, just you know try this you know the free one okay and I already installed that so I just need to open it and you need to install that app okay and just you know open the contacts tap on it and you have to just tap on sorry uh, cancel you have to tap on this back okay and it will you know do the backup for you as you can see see super backup backup completed successfully do you want to send this backup file to cloud if you like you can do that but I'm just selecting not now okay so guys after you know uh, doing the backup uh, you have to uh, go to okay let me exit this okay so you have to go to you know the settings of your phone and after that you need to find here apps or application manager so I have apps over here so I just need to tap on it and swipe to the right uh, to all tabs okay and here I have to find the you know the contacts and clear its data okay so let me find the contacts so okay okay so here I have the contacts so just tap on it and you guys you, you need to clear the data of it okay? so just tap on clear data and then tap as you can see the data has been cleared and you just need to go back and then tap on contacts storage and then tap on clear data and then tap on ok again ok as you can see contact storage data is also clear ok and guys uh, after that you need to restart your phone and let's try that if this fixes your issue or not okay so okay guys so suppose if this you know method one doesn't you know works out for you then you can try this method too okay so you have to go to the settings of your phone again uh, in order to try this method and you know, just tap you know, find your apps or application manager so let me tap on it and here you have to again come to all tabs okay and then you need to you know tap over these three dots over here and then tap on reset app preferences okay and then tap on uh, as you can see you will not lose any data so there's no problem and then tap on reset apps okay okay guys after that you need to restart your phone and you know, let's see if this you know, fixes your issue or not okay so okay so suppose guys you know this method 2 doesn't work for you okay so you can try method 3 okay so you have to uninstall the app that is creating the pop-ups uh, it could be any app like you know the Instagram Viber Skype Facebook or messenger okay it could be any app okay so you have to uninstall the the app okay that is you know, creating the pop-ups so in order to do that you have to go to the settings of your phone and here you have to find the apps or application manager so just tap on apps or application manager and you have to swipe to the right to this all tabs and here you have to find the app that is you know creating the problem for you okay okay so suppose uh, let me select this adobe appropriate over here and as you can see we have this option here to uninstall okay 
so you can uninstall that very easily okay so guys and after that you need to you know disable google plus okay so you have to go to you know the apps let me find this over here apps over here and find here you need to find the google plus so here i have just tap on it and you need to you know just you know, disable it so just tap on force stop and then tap on it. okay and guys after that you need to reinstall the app that was causing the pop-ups okay so the you know app that you uninstalled in you know step one you have to reinstall okay the app okay and if you like you can re-enable the google plus okay so in order to do that uh, you have to just you know find the google plus okay over here in your all you know apps over here you have to find the google plus and just open it accept the you know license agreement and it will be enabled okay if you like you can do that okay guys so uh, try this method three and let's see if that this you know works out for you or not okay so suppose you know any of the you know method one two three doesn't work for you so what you can do but you know in most of the cases it works 99 percent it works so suppose if you know method one two three doesn't work then you have to you know factory reset your phone okay so uh in order to do that you have to you know go to the settings of your phone and here you have to find the backup and reset okay so let me find that so here i have backup and reset and before doing you know uh, reset uh, you have to take the you know you know the backup okay so make sure you take the backup and just tap on you know factory data reset and just tap on reset phone okay and it will reset your phone okay but i don't recommend it you can try all these you know method one two three and let me know in the comment section whether it fixes your issue or not so that's it for this video and i will catch you in my next videos thanks for watching bye take care